Hey, I'm uh, Tom Fuller, production assistant on 12 Ounce Mouse. I'm Brad Zimmerman. I'm the senior editor at Radical Access Animation Studio. Uh, my name is Pierre Michel Serrato, and I'm an editor, compositor, animator. My name is Ted Murphy. I'm an editor for 12 Ounce Mouse. Hello, my name is Lear Bunda. I am a integral contributing editor on the show 12 Ounce Mouse. I was uh, part of episodes 17 and 18, and I did about two to four seconds of video. Easily the most difficult thing an editor can possibly do. You know, there will be points where there's literally a thousand layers of video. I mean, those characters are huge. We're talking thousands of layers here. It's like puppeting, but it's so weird because like, you're, it's, it's just moving these little clips around and just doing like little simple gestures, but it's really incredible that the, the characters are so simple, but the story is so deep that you don't really need that much as far as animation goes because it's just portrayed so well in the writing and, and just like the editing style of the show is it's great. Those are some dark times, but um, we're not, uh, not going to go into that. John started at the beginning as an editor on this and where it went at the very end where people's you know creativity went where the bar kept getting raised by everybody else I remember sitting around with Ted and John one night drinking and it's like you know John's looking at me he's like you raise the bar dude here we go after working on a couple of them you come to realize that the charm of the show and like the limitations of Final Cut actually contribute to the aesthetic and like the style of the show it is like one of the greatest things about it that it's like working with like two hands behind your back and you're and you're like hanging on a keyboard with your foot and you're trying to make it look really good because that's all you got to work with. A lot of scenes in there that that took more than just you know just a two-man conversation and it became became kind of something really fun to mold and you got more precious with it and you began to care about the final product. It just unlocks a part of your brain that lets you think in a certain way as far as editing goes. To understand at that moment that the editor is doing all the, all the animation, all the compositing, all the editing, sound design and on and so forth, you know, at least for preliminary aspects. It, it's, it's the one-man band, you know, you got your symbols up here, you're compositing over here, and you're animating down here, editing, you know, there with that. And uh, it's the most fun, easily the most fun I've ever had as an editor. It was a little difficult for me to learn the uh, the drawing style for Mouse. I mean, I know you look at it and, you know, well, a lot of people think, like, what, are they drunk when they draw that? And while we may be, or at least I know I am, uh, there's still a certain aesthetic in the design that you have to follow, not so much with scribbly pencil lines. Mm -hmm. If it took me longer than 10 minutes, I'd just crumple it up and start yeah. over. You look at the taxi in 12 Ounce Mouse, you know it's a taxi, but it doesn't look like any taxi you've ever seen anywhere. It was probably the best job to come into because, you know, Matt would come in, hand me a script, and then give me guitar notes. It's absolutely insane, and it does look simple. It's deceivingly simple. And it's just been a fun experience overall. <laughs> well, you know, there was the seed, and then we grew the tree. So yeah, yeah, we man. watered it with booze and nicotine. Um, do you want me to say, like, am I, am I talking to you, or am I act like, are you going to be heard on this, or am I, like, talking to things like Pretend like, like I'm not Matt. Matt. Hmm? <laughs> Pretend like I'm not mad. Right. So you can yeah. say, you can talk about me in the third yeah. person. Um. Although, it is me. <laughs> <laughs> okay.